tomorrow afternoon, first post time Tuesday, 1.30 Eastern time, and there are 14 races on the Tuesday afternoon program. The Trotters have reached the back stretch, and they are underway in the finale. And on the inside, Keystone Thunder showing. On the far outside, Cremor is coming up, and a slight edge for Keystone Thunder, but Cremor challenging. Four under par settles in behind the top two, about three off the pace in third. She is followed up then uh, by uh, President AZ. It's Laser Jet fifth. Then comes KJ Diamond, Tricky Dick, and the trailer early on beyond ordinary. Keystone Thunder won that early dust up for the lead as they come to the quarter mile marker in 27 and four fifths. They straighten it out here in Keystone Thunder. Kevin Wallace sending him early, but from third now the mayor four under par making a move for Mark McDonald. Two to five favorite will take the lead as they pass the apron dwellers. Back in second, Keystone Thunder. Then comes Cremor third as they move towards the turn. That's President they Zet in fourth. KJ Diamond heads to the outside looking to pick up cover. Inside sixth, Laser Jet. And then comes Tricky Dick and the trailer remains beyond ordinary. About 10 off the pace. Up front, it's four under par. Half mile, 57 and two, 29 and three. For the second panel, fractions not too taxing. That's four under par, matriculating down the track with the lead of a length. Keystone Thunder hanging around right behind. Third now is Cremor. KJ Diamond never found any cover, so it's a long grind for her first over. Boxed in fifth, President AZ. Tricky Dick second over sixth is about nine back after that laser jet and beyond ordinary. So, four under par still going along well. Keystone Thunder hanging around. Three quarters, 126 and two, 29 even third panel. Middle portion was soft. See if that's enough to get four under par home. And she extends her lead now to two over Keystone Thunder. KJ Diamond still trying on the outside, inside Cremor fourth. Top of the stretch, four under par has opened the lead up now to two and a quarter lengths. Keystone Thunder second all out, but having a hard time gaining. Cremor now coming through on the inside. Four under par will open up that lead a bit at the end. Four under par, rock solid up front for Mark McDonald. Wins it here by a length and three quarters. Keystone Thunder chased all the way second. Cremor third, and then it was uh, President AZ fourth and Laser Jet fifth. Four under par, Mark McDonald, 155 and three. And really a microcosm of what we saw today, and that was favorites on the front end. And uh, here is a four under par, controlling matters for Mark McDonald. No problems in the lane. The lead never really got too much longer, but also didn't shrink as he comes home a winner uh, to close out the day's racing. Judges have posted the unofficial order of finish race 14. Number 5, 400 par, finished first. Number 1, Keystone Thunder, finished second. Number 8, Cremor, finished third. Number 2, President AZ, finished fourth. Unofficially, 5182 in race 14. Heading back towards the Hanover Shoe Farms winner's circle. Unofficial winner of today's 14th and final. Number 5, 400 par, 4-year-old brown mare by Swan for All, out of Saucy by Muscle Hill, bred by Michael Bennett Wilt of Missouri, owned by VIP Internet Stable, LLC, Piscataway, New Jersey, and Tim Drag of Chester, New Jersey, John Butte, Shane, the trainer, the driver, Mark McDonald, four under par, two to five, a betting favorite. She's now won two of her last three here, eight wins and 18 